basically, ethics is a baseline. Ethics is what you need to think about to remember that lawyers are professionals. In order to have client centricity, in order to be focused really on what the client wants, you have to go and think about the intent, which is to balance what the, the, the law says and what you're trying to do for the client against the needs to make the client an important part of what you're doing. And there's a lot of things going on in terms of the way in which law is practiced today that tries to do that. More and more clients, particularly lawyers as clients, are asking that they be involved in the process of determining how you're going to solve a case. Not just the big picture, but little things like what's the budget? How's it going to be divided in terms of time and timekeepers over various parts of what we're going to do? When do I get a chance to talk as a client? So in order to turn ethics into something that you can use to differentiate your practice, you need to think about how you're going to take what the rules say and incorporate it into how you do your practice. If you're talking to another lawyer, jargon's fine. If you're talking to a human, jargon's not going to make any sense. So you need to think as an advisor about the content of what you're saying and how it should be. Usually, you're supposed to wait until you're asked for advice. It's polite, I guess, according to the rules. But in many cases, if it's going to matter, if it's material to the decision, you're going to offer the advice.